Hello, my name is Daryl, and I'd like to welcome you to Volume 2 of the Master Course Series on Cups and Balls. Now, on this volume, I will show you how to effectively combine several of these techniques together into full-length routines. Once you understand the basic principles behind the cups and balls, you can literally perform this effect with ordinary borrowed objects anytime and any place. First, I'd like to begin with Nick's routine. Here's the deal, it's a very simple routine, it's got a lot of variety of effects in it, and uh, the good news is there's absolutely no sleight of hand involved. Die Vernon routine with the cups and balls. Ball number one goes under cup number one, ball number two under cup number two, ball number three under cup number three, but the magic wand, very important. If I tap here, tap there, and then tap there, a very strange thing happens. The balls vanish from the end cups all to the middle, just like that. With that said, let's get started. Thank you. 